Greetings, this is Discipleship Empowerment Connection. My name is Dr. James Paul Humphreys, and I'm glad to be with you today from Canada. And we've got a beautiful fall weather here, and I'm standing on the back of my old Ford truck, wanting to come to you with a little devotional thought concerning the word abound. You know, Jesus wants us to be abounding in Him. And one of the things that as disciples, we need to be equipping ourselves daily and being mentored so that we can understand clearly what the Word of God is. So we have the word abound, and the word abound uh, means to have an abundance, to have uh, plentiful, to excel, to have sufficient, and to do together, to have enough. And our scripture verse for today is found in Romans 15:13. It says, Now may the God of hope fill you with all joy, peace, and believing, that you may abound in hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. You know, when you look at this heading of this section, it talks about glorifying God together. I think God wants to not only allow us to abound in Him individually, but He also wants us to abound as a family, as a community, and as a church. So we're going to look at three points really quickly here today. The first one is that we need to abound in the God of hope. We need to be in God, in Christ Jesus, because when we're in Him, He provides for us, through the power of His Holy Spirit, hope. Hope is believing in the things that yet lay ahead, that He will guide it and direct us and use us for His glory. Secondly, we're to abound in God who fills us, what the Bible says, with all joy, and with all hope. And that's unique, that He wants to fill us with all joy and all hope. And to be able to do that, we need to abound in Him. And as we abide, abound in Him and come together with Him, we can be filled with all joy, hope, and peace. Thirdly, we are told in this passage of Scripture that God is a God who wants us to abound by the power of the Holy Spirit. I don't think you can have the joy. I don't think you can have the peace. And I think it would be difficult to have even the hope without abounding in the power of the Holy Spirit. It was the power of Holy Spirit that raised Jesus from the dead and that we just need to trust in that same power that raised Jesus from the dead to infill us and to empower us so we can abound in Christ Jesus in all hope in all joy, in all peace. And so I encourage you today, in Christ Jesus we are abound in Him, but we can do it through the power of His Holy Spirit. So I exhort you, reach out to Jesus, for He is reaching out to you. Thank you for joining us from Canada, and may this little thought encourage you to walk in a deeper way with Jesus Christ this day. Amen.